Hello everyone, welcome back to The Medium. We have finally arrived at the Red House and in this episode we're going to be taking a look at what it has in store for us. Okay, Marianne, focus. This was your home once. There's got to be something here. Hmm. All burnt up, but I can still make out some of it. Hmm. Burnt butterflies, okay. A family photo. It's sad to see it like this. Left behind. Forgotten. Oh, are we meant to put it somewhere, maybe? Oh, we're probably meant to collect like three pictures maybe and put them in their right order. That would probably make sense. All right, so let's have a little bit more of a look around. Is that a dollhouse? How the hell did it survive the fire? Locked. Maybe there's a way to open it. I mean, you can just stick your hand in the top of it. <laughs> I guess that's not what she had in mind. I don't know. Well, here's another picture. Another photo. Somehow it feels wrong to just leave them lying around. I feel like I should find somewhere to put it. Yeah, well, we've pretty much already established where they have to go. I can't stand the look she gives her. She hates her because of what happened to you. She thinks it's her fault, as if she did it on purpose. She's still too young. She needs time to understand, but sometimes I'm afraid. Afraid she'll do something to her. I keep telling myself she would never. But then again, I know better than anyone. Everyone has their demons. True, true. Everyone has their demons, I guess. Have we already looked down here? What is over that? Wait, what? You can see it on the bottom right of the screen when I'm here. There's like something I can click, but I think that's inside the house. So before we go too far, let's see if we can stick these photos on the fireplace. Maybe in some sort of correct order. I think that's it. The Rekovich family history. Oh, okay. So that worked, I guess. I don't know. Did that activate something? Maybe it did. Oh, this is a mirror. I thought this was a door before. All right. Let's see what's on the flip side of this place. On the flip side. All righty. So here's where the fireplace was. Strange. It's like feelings etched into the wall. This looks eerily familiar. Okay, I think that's everything. Can I go that way? No. Why do I feel that's not all you are? Okay, interesting. Can I go through here? No. Hmm, okay, well that seems like everything here. Let's go back through. The dollhouse. Oh. It's open. Huh. It looks like a replica of the actual house. Hmm. A tiny mirror. I wonder. 
tiny mirror. Looks like I could put something here. Okay, so yeah, three tiny mirrors. Strange. It feels like something shifted. Oh, maybe I can place the mirror here in a certain spot. And that changes where I'll go through over here, like this mirror. Maybe I'll end up somewhere else now. I knew it. The dollhouse, the mirrors, it's all connected. This room feels very familiar. Oh, we can't put a butterfly there? Oh. Okay, we gotta collect something to put on there, I guess. Here we go. Probably in here. Hey. Another one of those butterflies. Locked. Four slots. I guess that means four butterflies. Oh, do we have to put the right butterfly in the right slot, maybe? Because I can't remember which one it was. Was the... I think the red one was first, right? So we'll put the red one down first. The red one. And then yellow, I think. And I didn't get anything to put on this here, this like little cradle thing over the top. So I guess we have to go back to the dollhouse and change the mirror. Okay, so we take this and put it over here now. Because the bottom one was the first place that we went in, right? So this top left one is the only other and the other area that's that we haven't been to. This room it feels like it's pushing me out. Like it doesn't want me here. Oh here we go. This is probably over the over the crib, over the cradle. That spinny Wait. thing. I don't think this belongs here. I do not think so either. So, we can open this again. And another one. Another butterfly. I hope I'm getting these in the right order. Otherwise, it's going to be a little bit of a headache to rearrange them a lot later. I I hate you. All of you. None of you know. None of you understand. I do. Another mask. Were those the friends Satinus talked about? Got anything else? Oh, we can cut this open probably. This is another one of those. There's something underneath. Those skin. Barriers. Here we go. What is this? A tea party with the devil? Okay, so I guess we put the masks that we've acquired on these dolls. So this is the first mask we got, so I guess we'll put it on the first one. I'm not I sure. Know. I understand. I can feel your pain. 
What the hell? All right, second mask on the second one. We can show them. We can make them understand. Make them feel what it's like. Okay, but we don't have anything here. We did collect the fish before that we can put back on the, what was it, the top left room? Or the top right room? I can't remember. We're going to have to go back to that area because we're going to have to put the, the fish in its rightful spot. So we'll take this and move it over here again. There we go. So did we get another butterfly? I can't remember. We did. We got one more butterfly for that. So we're still missing one butterfly and one I don't mask. need her! She took my mom away from me! I hate her! I wish she was dead! Lily, I... No, it was not my fault! What the hell's happening to me? I hope that's the last of them. I hope I got these in the right order. Must have messed it up somehow. Hmm, okay. I'll try switching these around. Save yourself. Let me help you. What about her? Leave her. Let her burn. Oh god. This place is like an emotional graveyard. Okay. Well, we know where this has got to go now, to that little tea party area. The textures on this dollhouse load, like, really slowly. It takes, like, a couple of seconds before these textures kick in. Okay, so we got the last mask. Stick it on this girl back here. But, but I can't leave her here. She'll die. God. Remember, mommy. It's all her fault. No, no, no. She's my sister. Then set me free, and I will save you both. Oh, what's going on? Why am I getting attacked? Where do I go to the mirror, maybe? Okay, I probably need to go back to the mirror when the bugs come. What the hell? Ah! Go, 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 go. from her bought its way out with our lives Lily she I need to find her this opened up a, like a, a different area when the when the mirror shattered the basement looks almost intact maybe I'll find some clues down here Tell me about the fire, Lily. You were locked in, alone? No. We were not alone. No? Who else was there? The voice. Um, I, I didn't invite it. But it came anyway. Oh, Lily.
Hmm. Is this where we came from? Yeah. Okay. There are some things in here as well. We can bolt cutter this open again. As per usual. A lot of love was put into this. But there's sadness too. Happy 10 year. Oh wait, happy anniversary 10 years. Time flies, huh? Here's a little something to help you keep track. I love you, you big dummy. Barely legible. But I can still make out some of it. Matter of time, watch shop. Is that everything here? I think so. I hear some voices though, so there's going to be another echo around here somewhere. Daddy? Where is Marianne? She needs to stay at the hospital a while longer. Will she be alright? I want to see her. She's asleep, honey. The doctors aren't sure when she's going to wake up. I was in a coma. That's why I couldn't remember anything. Listen, you have to come with me now. Daddy? Wh where are you taking me? I'm sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. Thomas. What the hell did you do to her? She's sick, but it's not physical. He was right. That terrible night, something has awakened. Something was born inside her. It's eating her from the inside, preying on her strength. Her little body withers. I have to do something. We need to do something. Wow. Okay. Heavy. Oh, we, we didn't go through here before. Find a way to open Jesus, the secret door. This thing is serious. Looks like it's military. Solid steel. Combination lock. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Um, is there anything do we have anything in our inventory that gives us some sort of hint, maybe? Postcards? No. Oh, here we go. I didn't see this before. If we go here and we use our insight, it sort of gives you like a clue. So it looks like there's three numbers that have been pushed. One, nine, and six. So if I had to guess, it's probably like a, a date, maybe like a year. And I'm pretty sure the year's not beginning going to begin with a 6 or a 9, so it'll probably be like 1996 or 69 or 66. Oh, there we go. For a pound. Is that everything? Wait, did that open the door? Yeah, here we go.
shit. What will it take to get rid of that fucking thing? Yeah, mate, I don't want to deal with that thing anymore. All right, so we got two different worlds here again. Here is the transformer that we have to activate, right? So we probably have to find another spirit well somewhere. It's done. They'll never know. They can never know. They wouldn't understand. They would never forgive me. But they are safe. That's what matters. Separation, it's the only way. Oh, there we go. We can see where it goes over there to the right. But we have to get that door open somehow. What is this place? Some sort of a fallout shelter? Oh, here we go. This is going to be some sort of out of body experience, I think. I have to open this up first. Oh no, we can just go through now. Okay. So we can't go straight, right? There's nothing over here. Oh wow. This is, uh, this is turning into a big maze. Can we go this way? We can. There. That looks like a way out. But it's half underwater. That looks like the way out. Okay. Oh, it looks like here might be our spirit well. Did that work? Yeah, it did work. We didn't have to do any anything extra for that. We could probably do an out-of-body experience here, because down the bottom, or on the right-hand side, it looks like there's nothing blocking our way. I mean, we've already got some... We've already recharged ourselves, so... I'm not sure what that would be for. Oh, we can actually go down the bottom here. I'm already completely lost. Let's get back. You know what we should do? We should get back to that transformer that we saw at the start and activate that first. I feel like that's what we have to do next. Here we go. That definitely did something. Oh, we can go through in our in our out of body thing again. Okay. Go through there. Is there anything over here to see? Doesn't look like it. Oh, I'm just, I just went to the same area, but I, I went from a different side. So this whole place just goes around in a complete circle. Interesting, okay. I can go this way as well. Wow, 
Well, I think that's, this whole area here is going to be just about performing out-of-body experiences, I think. Can't go down there yet. Chamber. Oh. Okay. Okay. Good. Can turn that off. So I haven't been here before. Hmm. Maybe I could pump out the water from here. Pump out the water. It looks like there's a map on the wall here. That's practical. Okay. Let's get a lay of the land. Okay. So down here it also says what the rooms are. So I think we're in the control room right now. And there's also a central train button and a north exit in front of us. Yes, it's on. Okay, this looks complicated. What are we doing here? Pump mechanism control scheme. Water level indicator measures water level in given chamber. Water flow direction. Switch direction of water flow initiates water pump. Huh. Oh, I get it. So that opens the water tank one, central chamber and water tank two, but the other two are completely filled. Yeah, because this is empty now, because it, it put everything over here. Makes sense. Alright, let's go over to West Chamber then, maybe. Naughty girl. Bitch! Ungrateful! Not for me! Not for me! Where would you be? What would you be? Charged, scorched, dead. You owe me! So I think this is the right number one. That was the west chamber. And we should be able to go all the way down to the bottom now. No! No! Oh. No! It wasn't looking at two screens there. <laughs> There. Now it's ready to gulp down some water. Oh, here we go. We can perform an out of body experience to grab more energy. And now we can go back through the moths. Hang on, was there something on the ground here? No. Okay, here we go. So let's go back to the control room and maybe we can do a similar thing with the with the east exit. I'm so glad you're here. All the others. Not enough. Never enough. Never full. Never warm. And her. Oh! Worn out. Rag! You! Same cloth. When the when we first stumbled upon the site, we thought it was just an old German bunker, a couple of corridors, maybe some outdated supplies. Two weeks of excavation later, we knew that old funny Mustachio must have had big plans for this place. A whole system of underground tunnels, reinforced concrete walls, the whole shebang. Guess he wanted to have himself a little forest retreat in case the whole master race thing didn't work out. The commies did what they do best, stole it for themselves. They wanted to repurpose it into a full-on nuclear shelter. They even got a power grid going, but that's as far as they got before the dream of Niva went to shit. Luckily for me, the entire thing was very hush-hush, and I made sure it stayed that way. As far as I know, most people who knew about it died in the massacre. I wouldn't exactly call it a silver lining, but still. 
If things go south, we should have a place to lay low. Wow. Okay, so let's... So that's sorted over there to the west. Now... Put all the water back over this way. water tank once, we'll transport this stuff over as well. So far so good. Now I can get to the other tank. Yeah, that was the plan. So now let's go to the east side. See if we can sort that out as well. Okay, we need to find a valve first. Yes. Agent Cutters to the rescue. <laughs> uh, we've used these cutters so often in this playthrough. Okay, looks good. We can put this on top and hopefully everything will be groovy. Second tank, ready for duty. Is that everything? Like, I thought there may have only been two tanks. Pretty, pretty girl outs. So many dolls to play with. Such pretty things to wear. Lillian, Francis, Nurse Ursula. And him. Well, I sort of lost my bearings a little bit. Get yeah. away! But they don't last. They never last. Mm, but you will. Won't you? Okay, so East Chamber sorted. And west chamber sorted, so we probably got to get the central area free of water now. That would make the most sense. There we go. So we got the, both bottom tanks full, and both these side chambers are half full. But the central one is completely empty, so I think that's what we want to do, right? Actually, now that I remember, there was some sort of locked area in the east chamber. So if we can just put everything in the west chamber and free up the middle one and the right one, that might make things a little bit easier, because I think we have to escape through the middle one, but there was an area of the right one that we still needed to explore. I don't know. Let's just put everything over here for now. And then we can explore both these ones. Yes. The central chamber is open. Get your ass down there, Marianne. Oh, okay. So that was like a big hint anyway. That we probably did it right then. Now we just got to get down there and not lose our bearings again. So, where was this? Oh, here it is. I swear this is the area that we can get through. Yeah, here we go. Oh, 
more shame. Never again. Let them look. Let them see. Let them know. Let them feel. Our pain! Should... Alright, can we hide here? I mean, if I walk Nine. straight past him, he's gonna see, right? So we gotta wait for him to move somewhere. It all ends in me. Well, that didn't work, did it? <laughs> I guess we have to try that again. No more hunger. No more cold. No more shame. Never again. Let them look. Let them see. Let them know. Let them feel. Our pain! Alright, here we go. Let me get back here. Oh, what the? No! Here we go, run over. You shoot it. No! Come oh! back! Come back! Wow, that did it. So we had to use our, like, out of body thing as, like, a distraction. <laughs> Alright, cool. Finally done with that monster, hopefully. Lily, Thomas, you are here. I can feel it. No, don't do this to me. Burnt to a crisp. Guess I should look for a spare. Oh, what is this actually? I don't know, some sort of small battery, maybe? That's what it looks like, at least. Here we go. There's a note. Here's what I think I know now. The powers come from the same place, but they can manifest in different ways. She seems to exist in both places, as if her mind can inhabit two bodies at the same time. To her, whatever happens in one place affects the other. Does she see the line between the two, or are they one and the same? New hypothesis, death thins out the veil between worlds so that a newborn mind never has to split. Makes sense? In a weird, fucked up way. Vitamins, antibiotics, neuroleptics, antidepressants. Even by my standards, that's a lot of pills. A lot of pills, that's true, but... Doesn't mean it's all for the same person. Here we go. Hey, I know this one. Used to be one of my favorites. It doesn't seem like there's going to be any more echoes. We still haven't found what we're looking for, though. I don't know, maybe we missed something? Okay, maybe we could have gone into a different area over here. Oh, this wasn't open before, actually. We can go this way now. I mean, I think this wasn't open before, yeah. Busted open. From the inside. Ah, oh, yes. All right, that's cool. That's what we're looking for. Now let's check out this room before we go anywhere. This was definitely Lily's place. Where he kept her. Salt. Who knew it was that simple? A bit of alchemy, some spiritual infusion, and there you have it. Looks like the folk tales were true after all. Anyway, the room is ready and it works. It actually works. For the first time in my life, I can feel alone. It feels fucking wonderful. Quite the selection. 
so she could doll herself up with no one to see her. Maybe he meant well, but somehow this just feels sadistic. Oh. She'd be a grown woman by now, but the room is still all dolls and unicorns. Little windows into the world. It's something, I guess. Sunshine doesn't really translate to text, though. Again with the salt. The whole room is lined with it. Yeah, it seems really weird. The salt. I don't know what's up with the salt. Imagine being locked up in this place. Having a needle shoved into your arm day in, day out. You didn't deserve this, Lily. Huh. Also got salt on a drip. Can we go in there? No. We can't go in the door. Okay. I think that might be everything. So let's go stick this, stick this battery back in the thing, or the fuse. And hopefully... Everything will be good. Alright, here we go. Oh, shit. Too much power. Oh, too much power. Okay. Oh, true. It's got to be in the good 50 zone. Oh, okay. My bad. Alright, that seems good. Investigate the living quarters. Done. So is that everything we needed to do here? I think so. Oh, this opened. Okay. Nice decor. Very uh, minimalist. Huh. Mold. It looks pretty fresh. Someone's been here recently. We can look at the mirror. Just check if there's anything. Here we go. It's quiet now. Just me and her. Just me and her. It feels strange, but in a good way. How, sh how it should be. I best enjoy it while it lasts. Already started moving the workshop over to the hotel. If anything happens, I don't want... I don't want her anywhere near it. I'm going in soon to get him back. This only ends in one of two ways. Either both of us are coming back or neither. Here's a mirror. Is that everything though? Before we click on the mirror? Alright, well, let's, uh, let's just click on the mirror, see what happens. Hmm. If I find enough pieces, I might be able to get to the other side. Better get to it, Alice. Okay, so we haven't found any yet. Can we crouch down in here? No. Oh, here's okay. one. Here's one. So far, so good. I can't believe I didn't see that before. Hmm, okay. I have a feeling they're not all in this room. I think we got to go back a little bit. All right, let's go back. Oh, this opened as well. I haven't been in here yet either. Here we go. There. Another one. Okay. So that opened up a few doors, turning the power back on. Okay, that doesn't work. Doesn't seem like there's anything else here. 
Oh, and this is where we were before. But we'll check if we can get to the back of that that room Lily was in, all right? Oh, we haven't been in here either. Looks like he could never quite let go of his passion. In another life, perhaps. She almost saw me today, sensed me. I should have known I need to be more careful, keep my distance. It's just that I just, <laughs> it's like struggling to write something. Not a good day goes by that I don't think of her. I know I did the right thing leaving her at the hospital. It's better this way. She's better this way. But I keep thinking of that day when it finally happens, when she discovers what she really is. She'll be confused, afraid. I should be there for her to help her make sense of it all, total, or to tell her that it's all right. No. She'll make it through. She's strong, just like her mother. Jack Orkin. This should be enough. Let's make magic happen. This was definitely Thomas's workspace. I can sense the determination. Whatever he was working on, he really gave it his all. Were you trying to send the monster away? Or to get your other self back? Crazy. Look at that picture down the bottom right. <laughs> Super freaky. All right, well, that seems like everything. Let's see if we can go in Lily's room and open that door that was shut before. All right, because there was a doorway at the back, and I'm not sure if that was, like, when we turned the power on. No, nah, it seems like it's still closed. Yeah, it's still closed. All right. Let's go put in the pieces on this mirror. And see if we can go back to the spirit world. Because we probably have to do something then in the spirit world. Because that's pretty much what all the all the mirrors are for. Oh wait, not in here, sorry. This way. So this one. Then I think this one? No. Ah, oh, there you go. And there it was. The moment we finally met. Spend years in Henry's fucked up world. Oh, ah. When you. You sent him away. I could. I could finally. break free. That's why you're so important. You can finish this. Where is he? Where is my father? I, I don't know. I... Um. For the first time in my life, I, I, I don't feel his presence. I, I, 
I've been away for so long. Could you... Could you stay? For a moment? Tell me... Uh, how... I'm all this... started. It all starts with a dead girl. What about Lily? Did my father... Uh... No. He couldn't have. He wouldn't. He loved her too much. Both of you. So, what happened to her? What is this place? This is where he kept her. That cell back there... It only exists in one world. It keeps the other one out. He built it so that he could be alone. It was the only place he could feel... ...normal. Separated from his powers. From me. Came in handy once Lily became unstable. Unstable? What do you mean? She's a medium, too, Marianne. A powerful one. I guess it runs in the family. When Richard... When Richard hurt her... It awoke something inside her. Something... Something terrible. It was only a matter of time before it got out. It's what your father feared. What he tried to avoid. That's why he called me. But that means... Yes. She's still alive. There's still a way to save her. You have to find her, Marianne. Where is she? Where is my sister? For you to go. I'll hold it off for as long as I can. I'm not leaving you. You can't always save everyone, Butterfly. Trust me, I know. I'm 
sorry. <gasps> No, no, no. <sighs> wow, I sort of got those end of game feelings there with that massive cutscene but we'll see where this heads off to now I tell you what though if we are getting close to the end it's definitely setting up to to look like a sequel to make it look like there's a sequel in the making this is it the place from my dream I've walked this path a thousand times in my mind I know every inch of it, but this time, something is different. Oh, she might actually just go find her sister now. I thought that might be the whole catch for the, uh, for the sequel, that she has to go find her, her sister. But maybe she'll just go find her now. Because this looks like we're at the lake anyway, right? I guess we will find I'm out. Close. I can feel it. I can feel it so clearly now. Yeah, that's it's definitely the lake. That horror feeling has also vanished a little bit. <laughs> Thank God. Here we go. For you, little sister. Lily, I... I didn't know. I couldn't remember, I'm so sorry. It's okay. But it was better that way. At least you had a life. That day, that day when the fire broke out at our house, I made a deal. The part of my soul that was tormented was set loose. You mean the monster? But why? To save you. It helped us escape the flames. But in return, I had to set it free. Free to devour. To destroy. 
to kill. The Neva massacre. Yes. All those people died so that we could live. Because I lived, so did my demons. Father knew my powers were too dangerous. He left you at the hospital so you could have a normal life. And what about you? Did he try to... No. Maybe he should have. But he couldn't bring himself to do it. Instead, he locked me away. But he only delayed the inevitable. Monster, he got out. And now you're here. You're the only one who can fix this. You. We both share our father's gifts. But also his fate. And the dream. The dream? I... All I see is a girl. You. Shot dead. Here, on this pier. Hasn't it already happened? No. It's not the past you see. The dream. It's what I want to happen. What? It all ends in me. But... No! N no! You can't send a spirit away while the host is still alive. That's why you couldn't destroy the monster. That's why Sadness didn't want to go. But... You're my sister. That's why it has to be you. I... I'm not strong enough. It... Uh. It won't let me. Only you can end this. Only you can fix what our father could not. Lillian, I can't. Please, don't I'm make me sorry. do this. It's the only way to destroy it, to prevent further bloodshed. Lily? Uh, oh! Marianne? What's going on? Skin suit. Now to swim. Constricting. Outgrown her. Don't need her. Gone, not done yet, but it's getting there. There is another way, Marianne. No. What is she doing? It's just it's like thing. you said. I'm your only chance, <laughs> aren't I? You need me. a medium strong enough to sustain you. The others? They only lasted for so long before you broke them down. Marianne, please. I don't want Maybe this. Maybe it's not your choice. Maybe this is my story after all. No! Stop don't it. do this! Please, sister. Set me free! No! Stay back! Stay back! It all has to be you. It has to be you. It has to be you. You'll never stop fighting. You finish this. Only you can end this. 
You can't always save everyone, butterfly. It all starts with a dead girl. Wow, that's the end of it. Okay, so we don't really know what happens at the end there, right? Like, we don't know if she shot herself or her sister. I mean, that's still pretty much an open ending, right? So there could always be a sequel to find out what happens. Possibilities are there. Okay, so, cool. Hope you, everyone enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching the series, everyone. I really enjoyed playing through this horror. Like I said, I'm not really that much of a psychological horror type person. Those are the sort of games that I don't really play, but I really enjoyed it nonetheless. And because I did actually enjoy that so much, I might um, take a look at Bloober's, Bloober Team's other game, uh, Blair Witch, because that has some pretty good reviews. And uh, from what I've seen of it, that did also look pretty interesting. So thank you guys for tagging along. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you want to see more stuff like this, different series, different games, different stuff, then uh, subscribe and be sure to know when I put out some new videos. And thanks guys for watching and I'll catch you in a different video. See you later guys. Have a good one.